Hey guys, thank you for joining me for another God's Woodsman video. Today, what we're going to do is I'm going to do basically a repeat of a video that I did back in the beginning. One of my first God's Woodsman videos. I think it was my first or second one. And it is how to make coffee over a campfire. One of my um, watchers totally schooled me and showed me a much easier way to do it over the campfire. Basically the exact same way I was doing it with just one minor difference. Coming up. Hope you guys stay with me. Alright guys, you basically start out the same way. Teapot, coffee pot, whatever, billy can, and some water. So first we're just going to fill this up with water and put it over the fire. And then just put it over the campfire, wait till the water boils. Alright guys, it should be boiling in no time. Alright guys, once you get to the point where you've got your water boiling, just take it off the fire. Carefully. Alright, now just like before, what I did at this point was take my little thing of coffee here and just add my coffee. And what I've always done was I always just waited for it to um, finally settle. Well, what somebody schooled me on on YouTube told me was what their grandpa always did, which when you get to this point, like, see how it's like really tons and tons of grounds in there? All you do is just take some cold water, which I don't know if this is going to be enough. I might have to add a little bit more. Add a little bit of cold water. I might have to add just a tiny bit more. And I know what you're thinking, like, but if I add cold water, it's just going to add just a little bit more to the top. By adding the cold water, it instantly settles all the grounds instead of it taking so long so it the ground settles so much quicker than what they did before I mean it's already broken a lot of the surface tension and it's not perfect yet but it's much much quicker than what it already was I mean before I'd be waiting forever for these grounds to settle and they're already settling quite a bit faster and if I need them to settle even a little bit faster, just add a little bit more cold water. And it does work better the colder the water is. This water is not super, super cold, but just add some cold water, which, yeah, does cool down your coffee, but you can reheat it back up over the fire, and which is fine. You know, you want your coffee to be hot anyways, and you're going to put it back over the fire anyways. So it'll settle much, much quicker by adding just a little bit of cold water. I've also heard people that say they add just a little bit of salt to it that'll help break the surface tension. So then when you get to that point, it's not perfect yet, it's close. And then just take your coffee pot and put it back over the campfire. Put it back over the campfire for a couple more minutes, get it warmed back up, and it'll be ready to serve. So just a little bit of an improvement on a time, timeless method of making coffee over the campfire. We'll give it a couple more minutes to heat up and be ready for coffee. Alright guys, you can hear the water boiling. Ooh, it's getting ready to overflow. You can hear the water starting to boil over there. All right, so we're just gonna take it off the heat and just let it cool for just a couple minutes and it'll be ready. But let me just go ahead and show you how quickly those grounds settled already. 
how quickly those grounds settled. It was just boiling and there's no grounds. Much, much quicker. I would have been waiting 30 minutes before to get the, the coffee ready. I mean, I'm, this is ready to pour now. So guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please give it a big thumbs up. It'll help support the channel and so more people can view this. If you have, you like this idea and you thought it was really cool, please share it. Put it on your Facebook, put it on your Twitter, Instagram, whatever. Just show it to your friends and, you know, let them come, you know, let them come and check out my videos and see the experience of what it's like to go out in the mountains. And please come out here and try it. Don't just stay there and watch from a TV or your tablet or your phone. Come out here and actually try this stuff. It's great. It's awesome. It's so much fun to do. And you're really missing out if you're just staying at home watching it. And if you're a new watcher and you really like this video and you're like, man, I'd like to see some more of this guy's videos. I wonder if he has any more. Lots more. Hit that subscribe button in the upper right-hand corner and you'll get new videos twice a week and you can check out my whole channel. Thanks, guys. Have a great day.